Scientists from the US National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration have discovered what they claim is an atmospheric aerosol particle. What's worrying is that this particle is enriched with the uranium which is used in nuclear fuel and bombs. The team was on a routine pollution sampling flight when they discovered it by chance, floating alone in the evening Alaskan sky. At an altitude of about 4.3 miles above Alaska's Aleutian Islands, it was unlike anything the researchers had seen in two decades of air sampling, a single radioactive aerosol particle containing a very small amount of enriched uranium. Uranium-235 is the fissile isotope capable of sustaining a chain reaction, meaning it's the kind of uranium used in nuclear weapons and nuclear fuel. While uranium-235 does occur in nature, the sample contained about three times as much uranium-235 content as would ever naturally occur in a sample of the metal at this size, meaning the particle qualifies as enriched uranium for the purposes of nuclear power generation or military weapons. In light of that, the fact that this particle was astray on the breeze over Alaska doesn't make an awful lot of sense to the researchers, who say the size of the uranium particle is too small to escape the industrial production of nuclear fuel. Given that the particle was detected in August 2016, it excludes the Fukushima nuclear power plant in 2011 as a possible source. The Fukushima nuclear disaster was an energy accident at the Fukushima nuclear power plant in Fukushima, initiated primarily by the tsunami following the earthquake on the 11th of March 2011. Immediately after the earthquake, the active reactors automatically shut down the sustained fusion reactors. However, the tsunami destroyed the emergency generators cooling the reactors causing reactor 4 to overheat from the decay heat from the fuel rods. The insufficient cooling led to three nuclear meltdowns and the release of radioactive material beginning on the 12th of March. Several hydrogen air chemical explosions occurred between the 12th of March and the 15th of March. The Fukushima disaster is the largest nuclear disaster since the 1986 Chernobyl disaster, and the second disaster to be given the Level 7 event classification of the International Nuclear Event Scale. On the 5th of July 2012, the Fukushima Nuclear Accident Independent Investigation Commission found the causes of the accident had been foreseeable, and that the plant operator Tokyo Electric Power Company had failed to meet basic safety requirements, such as risk assessments preparing for containing collateral damage and developing evacuation plans. Remaining in the dark about the origin of this particle, researchers suggested it's definitely not from a natural source. One of the main motivations of this paper is to see if somebody who knows more about uranium than any of us would understand the source of the particle. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.